My name is Amir Jaziri, and I'm a GYN oncologist at MD Anderson Cancer Center. So as a GYN oncologist, uh, we have a unique role, uh, perhaps in all of oncology, we're the only specialty uh, where we follow our patients from the time of diagnosis through surgery and then additional chemotherapy and radiation if necessary. So we have a long-term relationship with uh, the women that we have the privilege of taking care of. You know, I think as a medical student was when I had my first exposure uh, to GYN oncology as a rotation, and I was uh, really moved by uh, the patients who were battling these cancers and uh, their courage and their sense of positive um, attitude despite uh, going through something really hard. And I think that really stuck with me along with the fact that the physicians who were taking care of them developed these long-term relationships with them. My approach, and I think uh, that of many of my colleagues, is to individualize patient care. So. Many patients come here after exhausting um, other more conventional treatments. And here at MD Anderson, we have access to cutting edge clinical trials because of the successes of immunotherapy and many kinds of cancers. That is a frequent question that I get from patients is about the use of immunotherapy for gynecologic cancers and whether that has reached uh, approval or not. I think that's really um, what we can provide our patients that's not available just anywhere. At MD Anderson, we truly practice individualized uh, expert care approach to patient care. Um, I want patients to know that I'm gonna be honest and upfront with them. And uh, I want them to know that we do have treatment options here available that they're not necessarily gonna have available in their local uh, community uh, cancer care centers, and I think that's where we can make a difference for many people. My name is Amir Jaziri, and I'm making cancer history.